Hello coders and welcome to another How to Code Well PHP tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to be demonstrating how to count the frequency of array elements in PHP. We're going to be using array count values. So let's get into the code. Now, as mentioned, this array count values will count the frequency of the elements within the array. So let's say, for example, we're going to create an array that represents a shopping basket. So I'm going to create a variable called basket, and we're going to equal that to an array. This array is going to have a bunch of elements. Some of these elements are going to be the same. Let's say, for example, we buy some shoes. We also buy a coat. And I'm going to also add some more shoes. Let's also buy a pair of socks. OK, let's save that. What I want to do is count the frequency of our array values. So this will get the quantity within our basket. So the quantity of shoes, the quantity of coats and so forth. So what we're going to do is create a variable called order items. And this is going to equal the return of array underscore count underscore values. Now, before I supply the basket variable to this function call, let's first go and take a look at the PHP documentation. So I'm going to press control click on here. So it takes one argument, which is the input. This is an array, the array that you want to count the values from. So it counts all the values of an array. And you can see here that there is a link to the PHP manual. Do check this out for other examples. The parameter that we supply is the input. This is the array of values to count. It returns an array, which is an associative array of values from the input as keys and their count as value. OK, so let's go into the code and demonstrate what this can do. So what I'm going to do is copy the basket variable and we're going to pass it into the array count values function call. Underneath this, we're going to have a print statement. Now, this is just going to print out a pre tag. And then underneath this, we're going to call the function print R and we're going to pass in order items. After that, we're going to close the pre tag. OK, so before I go to the browser, I just want to mention that all of this code is available. I've got a link in the show notes below. And also there is a link to a video that I've done that demonstrates how to use the internal local server of PHP. So once you have all of that set up, go to the browser and point to this file, which is array count values. As we can see, the output is an array which shows us all the values and their frequencies. So we have shoes, coats and socks and the frequency that they are within our basket. So we've purchased two shoes. So we can see that shoes has a value of two. However, we've only purchased one coat and we've only purchased one pair of socks. So their values are one. If you found this coding tutorial helpful, then please do let me know. Give it a thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on other courses or tutorials like this one. If you've got a coding question, then please don't hesitate to ask, but do so on our Discord server. Go to howtocodewell.net forward slash Discord to join. Also, whilst you're there, do check out the other courses and tutorials that I have at howtocodewell.net. Thank you ever so much for watching. Happy coding, everyone. I'll see you again in the next tutorial. Cheers. Bye.